to YouTube. Well, as you know, I just got a 6S LiPo, 6S LiPos. So I'm going to be installing the drive shafts, which are right here, there, and the blue axles, which are right there. So for the first step, what you're going to need to do is just remove the wheel, and this is what we'll do. Okay, so as you see, I removed the wheels. I removed all four, just give me some more workspace. So what we're going to do right now is take off these. And to take off these, we are going to need to remove this screw that is right in here. Now the screw is removed, we can pry this off. Now the nut is off, what I'm going to do is remove this screw in here and this screw down here. Now those two screws are removed, the arms are free, and I'm just going to unscrew this screw. Okay, now as you can see, to just take it right off, what I'm going to do is remove these two, these pivot balls, and what you have to do that is just remove, turn the thread claw, uh, counterclockwise until the pin falls off. So I'm going to do that. So as you can see, uh, hollow balls came out and I won't be needing this anymore so now what I'm going to do is start putting this stuff back in here so as you can see I installed the silver plates and the pillow balls so now what I'm going to do is install the axle what I'm going to do is just pop this bearing in and take the bigger one and just pop it right in the rear just like that so you can see there's a bearing there and a bearing there now what I'm going to do is take it's put the actual axle through. So here's the axle. What I'm going to do is just put it, take it, like this angle, put it right through here, and pop it out. And just make sure it moves smoothly, and it does. So now what I'm going to do is put the hex adapter back on. Now with the hex adapter back on, I'm just going to screw the screw in. So as you see, I have the axle carrier right there with the axle pushed on. And now the hex adapter is on. So what I'm going to do is just do this to all fours, and I'll show you the process. Then I'll show you how to put it in your car. Now what we're going to do is that there's a little screw in here. And what we're going to do is locate the screw and screw it out. As you can see, the draft shaft is now in place. This should be play, but that's fine. What we want to do is just spin it to make sure that the other one spins too. So now what you want to do is just take the AR, sorry for the camera, and put the bolt in the air. So what, you, what you want to do is just screw this and that in. Now as you can see, we put on our wheels and now it's done. So that's how it looks. You got the steel draft shafts and the blue axle carriers. And that's out. That's it. So this is my rustler. I mean, this is my e-revo, sorry. And that's all up. That's the upgrade.